Good evening, YouTube. This is Max, episode 12, probably. Uh, 12, Delusion. 13, who, who gives a Ooh, shit okay, yeah. <laughs> It's Illusion of God. <laughs> How's it going tonight, Chris? It's going, buddy. Man, <laughs> this is 13 episodes over the course of, like, what, six months? Something like that. It's been at least four months. Yeah. Oh, it's been, because well, I me remember we were joking, like, I started this one around the same time I think I started Doom with Nick. Oh, wait a second. So that, that was fall, yeah. Didn't, did we do this after, was it after the, um, spook, spoopy October? Yeah, so the first it was like thing right we after did, that. We started, no, we started this right before. Oh, okay, oh, jeez. Yeah, then we took a break for spoopy October, then we took another break for Resident Evil 2. Okay, gotcha. Wow, yeah, we so, have been playing so this a while. What, yeah, so that, that's what keeps prolonging oh God. it, is that we get these, like, other uh, more pressing projects, but... Yeah, this, this I, one I really shouldn't have taken too long. No, <laughs> It's it not a terribly I mean, long a, game. It's not a terribly long game. It's got a great narrative and, um, you know, some oh, really come on. engaging dungeons, but you're right, it's, it's not overly taxing uh, no I, I feel like a, a speed run of this game would be like two hours or so i don't know about that but <laughs> yeah you're right it would not be super long i mean i feel like if you skip all the enemies which would be crazy i don't know i should look at a speed run for this game mm -hmm. yeah come to think of it i don't think i've ever seen a speed run done of this bad boy mm -mm, me either that is something yeah, i've this... been I, I love watching a good speed run seeing um well, of course, I just saw a... Am I going down? Where am I going? Where I am I? Road to the hmm. main hall. Where the hell are you? I can't be that far. No. All right, let's see. Is there... What's up here? So I'm not okay. uh, a big... I'm not a big fan of um, the Dark Souls or Demon Souls games. Like, I really suck at them. Okay, here, now you're huh. back. I, I really suck at them. Yeah, um, me too. <laughs> but have you seen previews of uh, Sekiro? Yeah, I have. Now, is that the same company? Is that from software? I, I'm not sure if it's the same company, but it's the same team. Okay, gotcha. Because people have been making comparisons, and, and I was yeah. like, wait a second, this is... I mean, I can kind of see it, but they're they're pretty different. This one seems... But, um, yeah. It, it really reminds me of Ninja Gaiden, which... Yeah, uh, gives that's me... what it reminds me of. Yeah, so I'm a huge Ninja Gaiden fan. Like, 3D Ninja Gaiden fan. I was never any good at the 2D ones. Okay, but, so you uh, liked... Like, I, you like pain. Played, <laughs> yeah, so I, I I played Ninja Gaiden Sigma into the ground. And uh, I I think I did a like main play, like a main story playthrough of Ninja Gaiden Sigma 2 on the PS3. Yeah. But I heard the third game was terrible, so I never bothered to... I so forget, I, think I forgot go there down was... Down here and then go up the stairs. There were stairs, yeah. I just did a loop-de-loop. <laughs> -loop. Um, so, Sigma so was I, just a, a kind of the Xbox version, or was that black... Yeah. Or yeah, Sigma was the yeah. PlayStation version or something, whatever. It was the PS3 remake of the uh, Xbox One. So so it um it had like much better visuals and some other like refinements to it, but it was it was punishing. That game was difficult. hard as balls. Oh my god, but yeah. For some reason, like it didn't turn me off. Like I just wanted to get really good at it and I did. I, I'm probably not good anymore, but um that actually Like I would be say one of the only PS3 games I hung on to. Wow. But yeah, that, those. So that I mean, I'd really say good. those are harder than like the the NES games. They're they're really punishing. They're punishing I games. Find, I find the NES ones way harder. They Maybe they are harder. extremely hard. I mean, don't get me yeah. wrong, but let's Something see. Some tells me you'll be going up there. Yeah. But um, yeah. So I'm looking at Sekiro, and the what I'm seeing wow. of it, the the gameplay looks like really smooth and, and uh, like a lot of fun. Um. The one thing, and this is going to sound like a really stupid complaint. It's just like one of those weird pet peeves I have about games. Um, so, how do I even describe this? Like, the way that the character interacts with the ground in Dark Souls games, yeah. it's kind of like they're not really walking on it. It's kind of like they're floating over it. You know, oh, okay. like, they, they don't have... It, it's not just like they don't have, like, a animation for going upstairs or anything it, it, it's kind of like the terrain doesn't really make a difference you know okay. like their movement speed is the same going through like mud as it is you know gliding on ice okay and, and I, I don't know and, and again it's it's not like a game breaking thing but it's like one of the first things that i notice like um really like floaty 
looking combat. But from what I've seen of Sekiro, he does have kind of like the weird movement. But the combat seems like really solid and really grounded. So I don't know. I may have to give it a shot. It, I don't um, think it's going to be like an immediate, uh, like full full price purchase. Now, but. When is uh, Ghost of Tsushima supposed to be coming out? I don't know if that was part of like the PlayStation Direct yesterday or not. But uh, which like, one is that? That's it basically when Sekiro was first coming out. I'm like, wait, is that that game I saw at the? Um, it was like at E3 uh, last year. Oh my god, what am I doing with this guy even? That one, Dying. I'm, not, I'm not even sure I know which game you're referring It's, um, to. did you, do you, what? did you see the Sony conference last year? Yeah, but I don't remember it. If you remember, they had some guy on stage for some, what am I doing? <laughs> they had some guy <laughs> on stage playing, like, Just the- beat him to death with your fucking flute, man. The flute, and, um, <laughs> speaking of the flute, yeah, they had some guy, ugh, playing the flute. There you go. In, like, in some kind of samurai, like, like, stealth samurai costume, and, um, then, then they showed the game. So it was basically like this kind of uh, samurai or feudal Japan or whatever uh, game. Did it, it kind of look like Bushido Blade? Like for... Uh, when you got into a fight, I think it did, yeah. Okay. Wait a I second. I may remember like what you were what you're talking about. Because I, I remember there was a game, and I, I guess I was thinking it was Shakira. Sek Shakira. Shakira. <laughs> Shakira. Um, <laughs> Sekiro. <laughs> Um, where I, I, like, saw the preview and I'm like, oh, dude, yeah, they're great if they did a new Bushido Blade. I mean, they look pretty different, but at the same time, the, the kind of game that they are, as, as far as, like, the, the, the time period, I'm assuming, with Sekiro as well, uh, you, you'd be forgiven for thinking they were, they were the same game, because they're right, also both coming out this year. Yeah. yeah. Um, Ghost of Tsushima, I'm super excited for, just because it's one of the prettiest games I've ever seen. Like, yeah, they, I'm gonna they, have to look that up. Yeah. Definitely look, it, it is beautiful. That, so that I E3... May, I, I may vaguely remember it, but I, I'm not solid. Get away from me. The, the game the game at the top of my radar right now, and this is stupid, but it's the Wind Waker. Uh, Wind Waker. Uh, Link's Awakening. I, my, my ears perked up. I'm like, Wind Waker? What's going on? Yeah, I know. Though, I'm really surprised that Nintendo isn't just releasing a... Um, Wind Waker and Twilight Princess HD like combo pack for the Switch. Just a collection, Switch. right? I mean, yeah. a combo pack like that, you could probably charge fifty dollars or full price for oh, something yeah. like that. You know, especially I'd because it. it would be the first time Twilight Princess is is in HD. Mm -hmm. Let's see. So yeah, no, you no, could... Twi Twilight Princess was in HD on the Wii U. Oh my god, I forgot that, all that's about why it. it would be so easy. It included yeah. the Wolf Amiibo and everything. That's right. I forgot all about that for some in, reason. In fact, like I've held off on buying that because I'm waiting to see if that's what they do. <laughs> yeah, it, I, I wouldn't be surprised. I, I think depending on like the success of Link's Awakening, it's, they'll probably. Yeah, it's also like, how could you not do that? Like, mm -hmm. unless you Nintendo hate money or also, something. Yeah, right. Nintendo is also. Um, it's probably like the last company to really get on board with doing actual remakes. Um, yeah. But now that they're there, I'm kind of, I'm kind of sort of wondering if Ocarina of Time might be on the horizon as like a remake. Um, Maybe. I would jizz my pants. Yeah, I would. I never, I never played the 3DS oh, remake. Oh, here it is. Oh shoot! Oh, it's the what's future. going on? It's me, City. <laughs> <laughs> it's the city for me. I don't know what the hell they were going for here. Like, Seriously, I think it's these, just so gray. Yeah. It's it I, it, it almost looks like a circuit houses. board or something. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It looks like the inside. Okay, so it's a motherboard with buildings on it. I'm yeah, basically. Sure it's oh, it's gray. So gray. Oh no. <laughs> you will usher in that well. well Spoilers. <laughs> yeah. Right. Will just kills himself. <laughs> like I've seen too much, <laughs> man. <laughs> I don't want to go to Me City. That's an interesting line. World people have. If they think they're happy, they'll be happy. It's a little fucked up. <laughs> and then one day they will vote a man for in, into the presidency that they don't fully understand. <laughs> you are the harbinger of Donald Trump. <laughs> oh, God. Dude, can we fucking commiserate for a second about the goddamn Mueller report? The, oh my God. Oh, fuck my I'm, life, man. I feel like I feel like a lot of congressional. Democrats put all their eggs in one basket with that. Like yeah, they kind of look stupid really now. And now. Yeah, now we look fucking stupid, and now he's going to be able to march into 2020. Be like, I'd be like, oh, look Democrat. at that! Look what they did! Yeah, wasting Jesus. your money, yada yada, the full exoneration. <sighs> <Yeah>. <sighs> I just fucking, just like 
put duct tape over his mouth and just now watch him the thing swear. is because of this investigation here's the thing is that what three people have been indicted or going to i oh, mean yeah, there's there's right. god oh, I, and, the and, names are escaping me roger right. stone there's a uh, roger stone um wait what's his name uh his campaign manager there's a campaign there's his lawyer michael flynn is it that's yeah. that's yeah, getting so three flynn. years there's his campaign manager oh, 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 i'm sorry michael cohen yeah. okay uh, so cohen um who was the campaign manager roger was something there a flynn? i think it was rod isn't it roger stone wait a second i, I mean i don't really give a fuck because i don't yeah everyone to do with his organization try to pretend they don't exist yeah but you're right so it was his campaign manager his lawyer and um and uh shit there was like someone who had like meetings they weren't supposed to be having yeah um and it wasn't Jer well i well, mean yeah, i feel like was, his his sons it, it, like it, that's it absolutely was his sons but yeah. they're invincible because they're trumps because they're trumps um, yeah yeah so and, and that's the point of this. Like, he says it's a full exoneration. It's not. It, all it means is they didn't have enough evidence to tie you directly. Exactly. They can't like, prove all, it without a the, yeah, shadow right. of a doubt kind of thing. Which what? is exactly how justice works and exactly what Trump would like to destroy, ironically. Enough. Yeah. <laughs> um, he, he would love to see people convicted off of, you know, just like, oh, I'm pretty sure he did it. Um, like, we all love <laughs> him. Um, but anyway, so... What drives me nuts about this whole situation is that he's so clearly like a fucking criminal. And, and, <laughs> I I, and, and it's just, we literally just don't have the evidence to uh, like concretely tie him to anything. But yeah. that doesn't make it any less true. Like all of these people just commit all of these crimes around him and he has no knowledge of it. Yeah, like, seriously. What the fuck is that ever the case? Yeah, why would these people be putting themselves... In, in such harm's way, like, doing right. these things without some kind of promise of something, you know? Yeah, that's exactly right. Like, they, no, they just love you that much. Yeah. That that they're that willing to betray their country. They're going to fight all these yeah. battles that you apparently have no knowledge of just to protect yeah, you. exactly. Just, they're not yeah, going to bring anything you to your sure attention. You yeah. What okay. a fucking crock of shit. It is. Um, I'm missing something. There's enemies. Okay, Wait. so so make a... Let's see here. I, I've been kind of paying attention. Make a try to shoot for those. No, don't go down there. Yeah, don't go down to your right. Do I keep going down? Is that whatever what I'm, you? Yeah, whatever that's... you do, don't jump down anything. Okay. See, that's what I kept doing. Ah. Yeah. I just kept going down for some reason. But yeah, dude. Like I, I, I know. Like, um, well, it's not really a show. We we do a lot of political talk here, which is yeah. you know part of you know what we're interested in. Trump but seems like, to come up in every just, episode. Yeah, <laughs> which it, I think is but, funny every single week it's not like it's you and me like making shit up about trump go ahead and send off a few red yeah tools. yeah it's not like we're making shit up about trump we're like doing these like wild conspiracy theories or anything he, he fucking like finds new ways to be horrible every single goddamn week yep and, and it's, it's just exhausting like don't you miss when politics was just fucking boring? Yeah. You know? I mean, there, like, there would be like, shit to Obama make up. That... Years, I mean, like, the only thing that you could really bitch about during the Obama was, like, certain conservative media outlets. They would, like, scrounge for different, like, um, uh, scandals that weren't really scandals. Oh, yeah. That was a shit show yeah. in its own right. It'd be like, yeah, oh, but, the uh, salute kind of scandal. Exactly. Like, hey, <laughs> the, the country <laughs> is moving forward. Um, the economy is recovering nicely. Um, Obama's doing things that I agree with, and not that I'd want to agree with, but I, I'd certainly like it. And, and at the same time, like, the, the conservative media was just kind of like this little gremlin. Just grasping know, at straws. Yeah, to... that we could all kind of poke fun at. Like, oh, Obama wore a tan suit, and he ordered Dijon mustard. <laughs> oh, boy, Obviously the worst political scandal ever. Yeah, right. And, and the Daily Show kind of makes fun of that now. Like, the worst <laughs> thing that any president has ever done. Ever. <laughs> Wear a tan suit? Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, right. And... But you know that that's what's that's what is funny about it is they weren't real scandals. The guy just showed up and did his job for eight fucking years and did it well. Yeah. And you know it was, it, it, it's so easy to forget that that was reality not that long ago. Yeah. But now do we not only have a president who, let's be real, is in all likelihood a a real criminal, um, who who's done things that, um, for, you know. Are they all, like, super damaging to our country? No, but if it were any other single president, he would be out. You know? Yeah. 
Um, but we just don't hold him to that standard for some reason. But the scarier thing is, like, his demeanor, his temperament, his constant tantrums, his divisive language, his calling the press, the enemy of the people. Like, these yeah. are things that we're not going to recover from anytime soon. This is like the new normal, and I fucking hate it. Yeah, the and, whole and fake so news like, thing where it's, I yeah. feel like they, they co-opted, the, the I feel like that term thing. came from us, and he made yeah. it powerful. Yeah, because well, like, he knows branding, and and now he's calling right. like CNN. I have people I know, and 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 like, ugh. I've seen that on Facebook a lot from people I know. It's just like, oh, CNN fake news. It's just like, god damn it, right. like that's and, and then like Im- embittering Democrats and Republicans against each other to yeah. the extent that he has. Like, we're not coming back from this for a long time. No, although like, I would say since Newt Gingrich, since the '90s, I mean the the Republicans oh, yeah. no, Democrats have just been at war. Do. You know, Obama, you know, I would say try to play too nice with them, which which is admirable. No. But it, yeah. it's, you know, I don't want to, like, play them at their own game. And, and yeah. I don't want to, like, say, oh, you know, we can never work with them. Bipartisanship, right. as long as we have a, you know, divided House and Senate, it's mm-hmm. it's necessary. But, yeah, yeah you're so, right. So Trump it, is Trump is definitely not, like, the original or even actually the worst offender of this kind of politicking, but he is the face of it. And he's just kind of got this, like, proudly ignorant, like, mania that that um, this, like, really horrible base has attached itself to. And, and so, like, what he represents symbolically is, like, everything that I hate about modern politics. And, and like... When he ta- when he opens that fat orange mouth to say something stupid, like I just can't deal with it anymore. Like it's it's driving me nuts. Yeah, it's it's kind of like you, you you think about when when you you know a really cynical view as far as uh, yeah. politics is just like a lot of platitudes and and, and lip service, yeah, right. and you don't really. Which, I've always kind of thought that it, it's <laughs> it's true, but it's so obvious with him. You know, he'll just say yeah. these things. You know, throw the red meat out that you know are is gonna get like the stupid this, his fucking base fired up. You know, um, right? Well, and, and then like to top it all off too, he has to drag uh, Christianity into it, which you know is quite personal for me. Yeah, like when that motherfucker like signs Bibles or has <laughs> evangelical like, Bible. yeah, dude, don't get me started on the fucking Bibles. <laughs> Uh, or, or uh, what, what else did he do? He had like this church choir sing um, uh, this Make America Great Again song and then fucking eating it up. And I'm like, I don't know how to explain to people that like this actually isn't Christianity. Like these people are calling themselves Christians when what they are is some kind of zealous political uh, cult. Like, it, it really is. Like, I don't know how to describe that in, in layman's terms. But, yeah. But that is not Christian. Like, as someone who... I'm I'm trying to think if, like, fascism has been... For a, li- a living, this is not Christianity. No. So, I mean, it fucking drives me nuts. Like, time and time again. Every time I see... Like... It, 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 and it's, it's super frustrating because there are people I know and people that I, like, really love... That actually fucking buy into his bullshit. It's like, well, yeah, you know, he's not perfect, but we gotta support him. Oh my him god! Otherwise, Most of the people, otherwise, the the liberals are gonna tear our our way of life apart. Like, no, they're fucking not. Dude. Almost everyone I've talked like, to, dude, say that. who who voted for him, uh, yeah. it, it ends up that they were just so against Hillary, and it's it's not yeah. even like the liberal. Although yeah. that you know, they'd probably tell me that too. But it's just like, yeah, but Hillary is evil, and you yeah. know, she is like the Hillary body count and stuff. It's like really, like they they right. bought into the fake news basically, yeah. <laughs> and oh. Benghazi well, yeah, it's like right. dude she's she's a political expert and yeah she is an insider of course she is she's a Clinton but it's a uh, travel to the labor traders village okay but sure why not at the same time though like let's be real here like she's a career fucking civil servant Donald Trump is a man child in an ill-fitting oh yeah suit. oh and I wasn't I, mean, I wasn't trying to say bad about her like a political no, insider no. it's not a bad thing yeah. she she makes most not people in the room look stupid in comparison you know she's really intelligent well and and ultimately that's what people didn't like about her it it is that elitism (laughs) fear of it's the same reason they didn't like oh 
Obama managed to find I'm, a way to be inspiring to a lot of people. Maybe for, you're probably right about a lot of people, but the people I've talked to, it goes into conspiracy theory territory. It's, well, it's, now that's what I, that was going to be my next point. Which ben, Benghazi, I consider conspiracy yeah. theory for sure. Right. So there's like a darker element to Trump's base. There's, there's like the people that you described as like, I just don't like Hillary and so I'm going to vote for Trump. Mm -hmm. uh, or I, I'm just, a, I walk the Republican line, so I'm going to vote for whoever the Republican candidate is. But then there's these people um, like it's the ones that Clinton identified as deplorables. They know that what he doing he's doing is like coded racism. They mm -hmm. know that what he's doing is wrong and hateful and evil and hurtful uh, to people of color and minorities and, and and everything else. And they just don't give a fuck. Like that's what they want to see happen. Well, uh, they're doing this like tongue in cheek. Like oh no no he's making America great again. Yeah for fuck. No, for fucking whitey. <laughs> you say, yeah, <laughs> some just... people don't care because there's just like the the other thought of it is so. Oh, Hillary, like uh, Benghazi, and uh, like really? Right. So you're gonna vote for this? Like t to not vote to stay out of it is just like okay, that's not good. Yeah. But whatever, I can almost like uh, you know, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna harp on them so much. But to go out of your way and be like, I'm gonna go for this guy. The guy who yeah. says grab him by the pussy. The guy who says yeah, I can right. shoot someone dead and you know no, and, it's and not all, even going to matter. And all rapists. And, and, and oh um, yeah, whatever the, the hell rapists else. and the these yeah. what are these 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 bad hombres like? Yeah, right. Fucking, like who the fuck talks like? I know that? Mexicans like, who I mean, voted for him, dude. People. All of, pe all of my uh, all of my terrible. Mexican jokes with you aside, who talks like? That? <laughs> <laughs> he's but fucking serious, serious like, about it and, and, and tries no, yeah, to tries to right. backpedal on it you know well, and, and that's the thing that's the thing um they the way that they get around that is either it's like oh no you've got to look for the deeper meaning in his words or they try <laughs> the to say deeper. yeah right like, isn't that no isn't that a, a wasn't that a defense from the white house itself yes like it's yeah, just you, like you, don't got, listen to the content look, of his words yeah. right <laughs> don't listen to what he says with his mouth look at the content of his heart or something shit how, like how would we know what that is these are you telling right. us how do you right, know no, well and that's the thing about trump if he has any redeeming quality at all which he doesn't um <laughs> if he has any redeeming quality at all it's that he is completely transparent like he thinks he's some kind of like savant yeah i don't, yeah, I don't think language. he means to be but you're right <laughs> no he, he he truly believes that he's the cleverest person in any given room yeah but he's a complete like you can always tell what the truth is because he is so fucking stupid with him and and, and so what they try to do is they try to play it off like the dark friar's powers like being this... increased again I'm, I'm assuming it's just the power of it and not yeah, once more. I don't think it can get any more broken. One, oh no, it's a thing. That's how once more the Dark Friar is flying. Holy crap, huh. okay. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Um, But yeah, so um, the way that they try to play it off is basically like what you and I do on this show. Where like, oh no, he, he's just really super irreverent and it's just some character he's playing. It's really yeah, 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 like he's fucking conservative because, Stephen Colbert or something. Yeah, right. Because he's basically made a career out of screwing and marginalizing minorities. Um, like that's just what he freaking does. Hey, I'll be right back. I've got to answer the door and pick up Sarah's pizza. You got it. Ooh, pizza. Oh my god. Go Sarah. <laughs> Late night pizza. Hitting snakes. Waiting for that pizza. Where's Max's pizza? I could use some pizza. Ooh, I got a got a pretty good thing going here. <laughs> this is this is working out pretty well. Yeah. <laughs> Mmm, pizza. Oh. I just kind of fell into this. You got pizza? You already got a slice mm -hmm. in your lusty oh, mouth yeah. already? I do. <laughs> you, Dude, what the hell were you we talking about fuck. now? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I've, I think we talked snakes. about this last episode. I've been doing a lot more weights at the gym. Ooh. I'm so fucking sore. <laughs> uh, that's what I did to do. Oh, he's two jewels and I already sent to the jeweler. Okay. I mean, I'm completely countermining it with the pizza here but you know <laughs> oh whatever you're, you're going for gains you're not you're not going for weight loss so much with that i'm really not i'm going for weight loss <laughs> i'm just completely blowing it right now. <laughs> what kind of pizza where'd you get it from 
No, oh, she just got Papa John's. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> um. Sorry, let me just masticate here on the air. Um. It's just like, where are your values, <laughs> Chris? Where, where, yeah, right. where did that fire in your belly go? <laughs> and being replaced up. with cheese <laughs> and pizza. <laughs> it's melting all the cheese right now. <laughs> yeah. Um. Words. What was I talking about? Pizza working out. I did. I did upper body today I had a point. with the workout. Oh yeah. So, <laughs> so um, doing a lot more home cooked meals. Like making a point to eat out less. Today was just like super long. So Sarah was like, "Hey, I'm gonna order a pizza. You want some? Yeah. You bet I do. Hey, fucking jackal. But yeah, just doing like a lot more home cooked meals and like trying to control my portions and shit like that. Yeah, I'm uh still seeing the dietitian. I'm just trying to um. My my thing right now is doing very simple meals, meals that usually mm -hmm. what's going on? Um that take like thirty minutes or less, like turkey meatball, yep. simple chili. Which which kinda yep, sucks because I, I usually like to put a lot of effort into my meals and do like an hour or two of cooking, but um yeah. I've noticed I'm not doing it as often. And right. I'm I'm not yeah, looking that, forward that to it right now. It was, we would buy, buy these like super healthy recipes, but they were like really complicated and you know like who yeah. Time. Yeah. So basically, what I did was I just kind of went back to a lot of the foods that my dad made when yeah. I was a kid. Um, and you know, I mean, they're not like ultra health food, but they're certainly not bad for you. So. Okay. And, Biggest thing is I, just like if it's if it's filling for you and you enjoy eating it. I think that's right. kind of if you're taking small steps. Like, yeah. Right. And, and and it's more like kind of controlling how much goes on my plate too, which is. A big part of it and that, that's usually where it is like i just like food you know so like i i take massive portions when i really shouldn't yeah me too but i think it's like if you if you like the food it's not terrible for you like mm -hmm. i feel like if you're restricting or you're you're eating things you don't really like you're just gonna fall mm -hmm. off the wagon and and go yeah, go right. fucking hard yeah, <laughs> you know as soon as you're off diet mode you just relapse so the nice thing about these meals is like i said they all kind of stick to like the um protein starch vegetable format mm -hmm. and there's you know they're you know i could make them That's every fun. week and i mean if you got for five bucks a plate a lot of starches i mean you got sweet potato any kind of potato really I mean, it's they don't mm -hmm. spike your blood sugar you know they're they're a slow right. carb they they keep you full and they uh mm -hmm. yeah it's like a consistent oh. consistent uh consistent what do you call it burn or something yeah. Yeah, and, and I know from previous weight loss efforts, I really don't have a problem with carbs. It is literally just my appetite and stress eating. Yeah, for me too. It's uh, around work especially. A lot of, a lot of kind yeah, of binge I, I'm, eating, I'm unfortunately. I'm like really fortunate in that way. Like, I don't have, like, ma any food allergies or, you know, mm. bad reactions to foods in general. Like, dairy, oh, I'm that's Oh, that's lucky, because yeah. like, carbs, I'm okay. Dairy, though, I... I need yeah, a bunch of freaking lactate. It fucks me up hard, <laughs> man. It sucks. That's a bad time. <laughs> and I and I fucking love dairy. Are you kidding me? As a kid, <laughs> right. I was eating cereal and oh, pyramid time. Here we go. Eating Maybe. cereal all the time. I love cheese. And that's the thing is I've noticed that unless I'm like it's a special occasion and I'm eating out to, for the sake of eating out, or I'm getting right. Mexican. And Mexican just sucks without cheese. I'm sorry, man. But um, <laughs> So I'll make a I'll make an exception for that, but like when I eat at Subway, any kind of sandwich I make at home, I don't I don't eat yeah. cheese anymore. Oh God! You know though, like one of the things that I found about like fast food places, if you cut out two things, Hello. cheese and mayo. <laughs> nice. If you cut out uh, cheese and mayo, you lose like half of the fat and calorie content, and it really doesn't fucking taste any different. Mm. The thing for me, like, yes. It feels like yeah, here's Shadow. Shadow! Like, I'm sorry. <laughs> I know my Dark Fryer just got, um, upgraded, but never again. <laughs> See you in hell, Frieden. Actually, I think we do need Frieden for I, part of I, this. I but... think, yeah, I think so. <laughs> but yeah, like, basically I've started doing that, too, where, like, if I have as well. the option, like, uh, if I'm getting, like, a fast food burger or something like that, or a Subway sandwich, like, yeah, skip the cheese. Yeah, I don't know. I think for certain certain things, I think I need the mayo. 
Mustard doesn't add too much. It's like I, I think I need the mayo. Maybe light mayo is fine. But yeah, I usually do, I always do light mayo. <laughs> yeah, on, on the subway sandwiches, I can usually skip the cheese and it's okay. Especially if you have either light mayo or you got some oil or something else going on. So right. That's yeah, salt, salt, pepper, and oil at subway. That that does the job. Yeah. But I, I do like. Although them. I have had their garlic cheesy bread, the the new bread that they're hawking, it's fucking good. <laughs> oh, is it? It's just they have this garlicky butter that they throw on it, so that's like double dairy basically, double dipping in the I dairy guess. there, and uh, <laughs> and then they just throw a bunch of mozzarella cheese on it, and then they bake that for a second <laughs> before they even start making your sandwich. Um, shit, Dude, what did he awesome. say? Smart as above ground, most of it is below the surface. That's okay. So she's just walking you through the fact that Shadow can like transform. Can go into a puddle. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I got my puddle powers. So really... Oh my god. Yeah, so there's this like super yes. long arm, yeah. Whoosh, 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 that's whoosh. that's the best part, really. <laughs> he's just he's just cheap with that. More yes. range than freedom. You, you can just me? like keep like he doesn't have any like um knockback. You can just keep spamming it. So now here's the main room, right up here. This is where you have to put Oh, where you put the little the, the little things, yeah. Yeah. That's right. This place is basically just go to this part, now go to that part, go to that part, kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Look at these tough so guys. He just gave hey. you a hint. <laughs> what do you say? So that guy just gave you the hint. When the jackal so really has Kara, you want to play the flute, and that'll set him on fire. <laughs> uh, you I have to. Pyramid. Damn it! Son of a bitch. <laughs> How did, so you, how did you remember you that? I have to sink, don't I? Because, yeah, because it's literally all just from this main hall. Okay. Like I said, this, oh, this God. dungeon, it's not a super complex layout. It's actually really compartmentalized. Dash, you fool. Slide. Slide, slide. Now slide to the left. All right. Slide let's, to the right. Let's get healed Reverse, again. reverse. <laughs> reverse, reverse. Dude, I haven't been to a wedding in so long. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to, my cousin's getting I, I, married uh, on May 4th. So Sal? yeah, to show off my dancing nice. skills. Yeah, nice, yeah. nice wedding date. I can, I can go for some electric slide right now. <laughs> <laughs> and some fucking cake. Oh. I don't know if you were there for it at at my wedding. Um, DJ just started doing like all the slides at at one point where it's just like let's do the electric slide, let's do the cha cha slide. <laughs> all right, wait a second. Cha cha, real oh, smooth. Oh, that's right. Okay. Oh yeah, you have to equip this. You power. gotta equip this thing. That's weird, man. Do I just go down? That is weird. Yep. That's it. Blah, 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 you can almost like, you know what I picture is, uh, you remember the Secret World of Alex Mack? Yeah, <laughs> the little Terminator that's, puddle. That's what I picture. Yeah, right. That just takes me back, shit. doesn't it? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. And another. Is this just yeah, a... so basically, like, like I said, we're literally just making our way through these rooms. Okay. I don't need you. <laughs> I don't need you. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> <laughs> just dives in. <laughs> just dives right in. Let's just start from the left. Let's just fucking do this. Just work our way over. Oh crap, we oh, might need come will on. for You need will for that? Bogus, Maybe. man. So once we actually get the, um, whatchamacallit, the, the MacGuffins here, yeah. we're basically just done with these areas. <laughs> yeah, now, too. if I remember right, there may also be an invisible enemy here that kind of is a pain in the ass. Because you, they're, they don't think do you're... a lot of damage, but they're easy to miss. I think you're right. Oh god. There's also, like, there's some parts where you're supposed to go into puddle mode, but it's not super obvious. Like, look at the stairs and see if there's, like, bricks below them. Go back to the staircase behind you here. If there's go down. Oops. Doing it again. I might be on drugs. Yeah, just to be sure. Hmm. Yeah, I wonder if I do yeah, need Will. I, I don't know. I'm I might be remembering right. You might just need Will. Alright. Well let's see what's go behind door, door number two. That's right. With the oven mitts. <laughs> <laughs> There yeah, alright. These, thing, nice. these things ain't no thing anymore. No, oh God. Shadow, uh, Shadow has a very low threshold. <laughs> I fucking DBZ power-ups <laughs> to get things towards uh, me. 
I'm also okay, magnetic. that's what I was remembering. Right there. You oh, can here? Down. Okay. But I would go down the stairs Shit, first. Shit, uh, too late. <laughs> no. Maybe they go to the same place. No, they don't. I... Of course well, they do see. <laughs> Oh, God. Wait, wait. Where am I? Going even farther down. Yep. I think you're going the right way for what it's worth. Yeah, but I sure did pass a lot of them. Yeah, I gotta kill these Just enemies. A bunch of enemies. Wait, does this really say there's only two left? Yeah, but that might that? that might be they might be divided into different rooms. Oh my god. Yeah. Forgot oh. about those guys. Alright. So I guess for Yeah, those spear dudes. For those guys, them. maybe the Dark Friar that would be good. Feet. And that's the thing, if it wasn't for the Dark Friar, Freedom truly would be he kind of already is useless just because of this. This action right here, like... Yeah, fu, 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 fu. Do you only get, like, the little bird with the last battle? Uh, yes. I believe that's a final boss only thing. Damn. You know what? I don't even care. Fuck you. Just yeah, go yeah. for it. <laughs> Let's just go. Do it, Shadow. Dunno. That might also be a place. Was this, um... Yeah. But I would go down the yeah, stairs. Yeah, let's, let's go down the stairs first. What the hell? Okay, there you there go. You go. There as you long go. as you can get Just gotta get below them. So bad. Yeah, right. I don't know what to do with these guys as not Will. I've, Will can at least slide them in one hit and one shot them. Right. Sh Shadow's getting the job done, though. Just remember to block when they shoot their lasers. Oh, wait. Dodoy? I forgot all about. I was like, I don't, I don't have my little flute, man. Of course, I can't block. What do you think I am? Some being of pure energy? Yeah, just made of fire. Oh wait, oh, shit, that doesn't actually, work. No, doesn't... Oh, <laughs> the no. blocking, it does nothing. I led you wrong, son. <laughs> you led me astray, oh Why cruel shepherd. <laughs> How could you? <laughs> oh dear God. There we go. Oh, and an attack up. Nice. We just made Shadow even more lethal. <laughs> Well, shit. All oh, right. This might be our first. A red nope, jewel. Just a red jewel. All right. Uh, go to your left. There may be some blocks below you that you can spooch no, down. I'm not even gonna. Ah, uh, there. I think there was. That... Oh, let's make that sure. One? Nope. No. But no spooch there. There was something. Spooch. Probably not there. <laughs> no spooch. No spooch. <laughs> spooch. Spooch. I feel like this is. Yeah. Spooch! Okay, they kind of have a look to them. Yeah. At least I'm not totally crazy. Wait a second. I thought I was remembering that wrong for a minute there. This... is this the same area? Yeah, it is. <laughs> yep, what fuck the, you. What the fuck? <laughs> it's just a... it's basically fast travel for Shadow. So what was that? Red... it was a red jewel. Yep. And... okay, yeah, that's right, I just got the defense. Yeah, so I think you're actually good for this whole stairwell. Okay. I skipped a lot of stuff, didn't I? So let's let's just start. Uh, yeah, just back. Don't do it. That's not you gonna know, take me anywhere, is it? It's just the shadow shortcut. Okay. Don't fall for it. <laughs> okay. Now here, so there's gotta be more to this area. Now wasn't there even another area before this? Wait a second. We can at least get one of these stone tablets before we call it an episode. <laughs> Seriously, I, know we I better. I don't remember the pyramid being too bad. No, it's not super taxing. Here uh, swan died, okay, baby. Yeah. Woo! Caw! <laughs> Caw! <laughs> I just picture like the Assassin's Creed. Caw! <laughs> oh. No. No. Okay, I can go. What the hell is the point of that? Have I been here? I th think so. Yeah, I think you're right. This is where I came from, isn't it? Yeah, wait, this is door wait. number two. Okay, well. What was the point of all that? Let's do this, just in case. Cause wait, wait, I... wait, go. Yeah, is there yeah. Spooch, spooch down there? Spooch. A spooch. Spooch. Spooch for America. <laughs> make, make, make America for spooch. freedom. Oh, that's where we stopped before I got the damn pizza. Yeah. So basically, I feel like the president has hijacked my faith, and it really disturbs me. Oh yeah. <laughs> that's, He's well, using that's it. Well, that would be the end of our Trump conversation <laughs> for tonight, but. Like that, I think more than anything, that's what I hate because, like I said, there's people I know who have like genuine faith that just buy into this man's fear politics and don't realize like how anti-Christian it actually is. And there's some people who they they will just vote for the quote-unquote Christian candidate no matter what. 
Yeah. And bear in mind, that, that's he's not, more of an but... invention. Yeah. That's actually more of an invention of the Reagan era of politics than anything else. Yeah. Um, and, and, you know, fuck that. <laughs> I mean, there's just... Did we really, like, explore so, that area for all it's one, worth? One, two, three... There's six of these things, right? Yeah, and there's six doors, so that there's got to be one there, and we just missed it somehow. Yeah, I'm going to be stubborn. I'm going back. <laughs> like. Yeah, I would. Like, I don't blame you here, because... Wait, Let's... check your inventory. We didn't somehow collect it, did we? No. Did we? Wait, wait, wait. What, what, what's that thing on the left? Yeah, that's what I want to... Why did I somehow have been playing this game for six months? I still don't know the damn controls. Oh yeah, my da Info daddy, on daddy's journal. This could be good to have. Hmm. It says there's a key okay. to solving the riddle. Blah blah blah. Sounds oh, so right when we get them, that's the order they have to go in. Okay. Bird, that's snake, something, something, something. Okay. Well, that was useless now, what, what, for the in most your inventory, part. What's all the way on the left? Lola's letter. Lola's oh, these guys. I remember these guys. Been okay. I forget all about you. Good luck on your super dangerous you. adventure, saving the world. Right. I love how they sign it, Bill and Lola. Like, not you know, your loving your aunt and uncle, grandpa and grandma, or something. Yeah, right. Bill, Lola. <laughs> Yeah, okay, hmm. we definitely don't have one yet. Russian but... glass opponent, okay. Oh, Russian glass. <laughs> Lest we forget. Good god. Okay. So now, what the Let's hell go... do we do? Just to make sure there wasn't some... Well, what, what's, uh, what's, like, above you there? Like, is there anything... Can I what, interact what's, what's with this? this? Yeah, what's this shit? No. No, no. They worship I the oven mitts. But if I go back to the, the next area... I keep wait, wait, going. wait! Go, go up, go up, go up. Spooge right there to your right. Right here, or yeah, right, right here to your right. Yeah, right there. Yep. I think I've done this. Have you? I think. Yeah. Okay. And then you swan dive down. You're yeah, right. it's the swan yeah. divey. Yeah. Whee. What about over there to your right? Mm -hmm. More spooge. Spooge? No more spooge. No spooge. <laughs> Come on! I would. I just want a spooge. I want to get to that long hallway. Uh, that's right. I just I just did it there. And wait, Jesus, how do we get back there? It's, it's taking you to the same place. Damn it! Or is it? Yeah, no, there it is. Okay, let me let me not swim. Go, go all the way to your right. Yeah. No, okay, you know, I think you're in good shape. Wait, now what? Now okay. here's where we got the red jewel, but there's there's got to be. And it's also some. Maybe maybe one of the shortcuts is more than a shortcut. So let's start yeah, here. Spoo yeah, start spooging. <laughs> just start spooge spooge, spooge, spooge everywhere. <laughs> spooge everywhere. Just do it, man. Wait. Is this the long hallway? This is, uh, this is new, maybe, uh, or maybe it, not. I don't think it why is. Why does it all have to fucking look the same? <laughs> it does. Hey, remember when I was all like, "Hey, the the pyramid's super pyramid's linear, easy, not that bad. yeah, right? dipshit, <laughs> yeah, asshole." <laughs> Spooge? No. Come on, this this reeks of there's something else here. There's something here. Come on. Okay, so not to, not uh, all the way down, but you may want to watch like one of those speed runs in between episodes. Son of a bitch. <laughs> there's this something. is this is just gonna take me. Yeah, why why would it take me anywhere else than? Yeah, right. Well, why would it be helpful? <laughs> Something all the way to the right. This I, this one I know takes me just to the hallway. Yeah. That one, yeah. Why would so that take me anywhere? So maybe I was anywhere? wrong about the one all the way to your right on this floor. Go, go up and all the way to your right. Remember, I was like, "Hey, don't do uh, it." Oh just... yeah. I just want to see what this is. Nothing. Yeah, maybe I was you wrong might about be right. One. You might be right that you were wrong. Wait for it. Please take oh. me somewhere. Oh, this I think, seems I think different. I think it does. I think you did it, Max. Oh, you did it, baby. Yeah, there we go. All right. Go Let's through go that through door the door first. first. Yeah, do not stop. Here oh, we there go. It is. Tight. It's a lithograph. Litho lithograph. Hippogriff. Lithograph. Have we just gone into Harry Potter land? <laughs> I think so. It's a hippogriff. <laughs> it's a hippogriff. Caw. <laughs> <laughs> no, Caw. Dude, speaking of fake news, like. 
<laughs> What's JK Rowling doing these days? Wait, wait, wait. J no, no, no. Yeah, no, let's, no, swan let's swan dive. I just wanted to make sure that was what. Oh, oh okay. Yeah. yeah, damn it. <laughs> yep, sorry. That's but it okay. Was worth checking. Yeah, of course. Um, <laughs> yeah, dude, what is JK Rowling doing these days? Why is she just like inventing the weirdest shit about her? Wait, I saw a click. Franchise? I saw a click hole article that was kind of making fun of something like that. So I want to know what's what's she doing? What's what's actually so going she, on? She announced that um, officially in in the canon of the Harry Potter universe, Dumbledore and um, Grindelwald had an intense sexual relationship. I mean, but but it's not referenced or even alluded to anywhere in the books at all i mean apparently. i i kind of figured they were lovers so, i don't know if that was actually alluded to um i feel like she's saying this now because it's gonna come up in in uh what do you call it the fantastic the beasts yeah but now i, ha I haven't thing. seen I crimes of grindelwald because i think they're trying to keep you know it kind of ambiguous so like if you're an adult and you want to read that into it fine but, you know, if you're a kid and you're not ready to, like, process, like, the complex sexual relationships of doing it with your worst enemy, <laughs> then you don't have to. And, you know, like, I, I think that's kind of why it works. So the way that it sounds right now is it's like she's just writing her own fan fiction. And, and so, like, now people are making all these memes. And it's like, um, people are just like, say, hey... Uh, J.K. Rowling, will you sign my uh, po uh, my copy of Prisoner of Azkaban? Yeah. By the way, did you know that Dobie was addicted to crystal meth? <laughs> Why? <laughs> she's like, uh, she doesn't want to write another book. Yeah. She's, right. she's, she's just like, has to stick to this lore and keep expanding the universe Whoa, somehow. Hey, it's, it's J.K. Rowling. Will you take a selfie with did you know that Ron actually killed someone over summer break and buried their body outside of the grounds of Worth's? <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. All canon. <laughs> Why? <laughs> I remember there was a there was like a click hole thing and it was um a, a basically oh JK Rowling's at it again. It seems like a, a well to go to pretty frequently and that now yeah, that you're mentioning yeah. this where yeah. she's just like did you know that the sorting hat usually divides people into into four houses but every once in a while it sends a kid to the New York Mets. Yeah. <laughs> and then it's just like uh it's pretty rare but once it happens the kid has to go. He has no choice. And so <laughs> It's like, it's well, like yeah, what the hell? one of the Weasleys, the, this Weasley that you never even heard of, was sent to the Mets. That's why you never heard of him. <laughs> right? Like, who the fuck cares? This doesn't <laughs> add anything. You're just, you're just taken away. <laughs> Whoa, it's J.K. Rowling. Hey, can you tell me a little bit more about the Deathly Hollows and what they really were? Yeah, but first, did you know that Snape fucked the Snorting Hat? What? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Did you, also, yeah, one year, did you say the one year, snorting? He just got hat. really drunk and he just stuck his dick right in there. All cannon. All, ca all cannon. All cannon. All cannon. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, see, these memes are fun <laughs> because there's literally there's literally nothing that's off the table apparently. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, that's hey, something for Will. This is so awesome. Hey, how did you get inspired to write your books? Well, I can tell you that, but did you know that Cho Chang is a lesbian? Also, she she raped Dobie? <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, God. I'm pretty sure you said snorting hat as well. <laughs> snorting hat? Yes. <laughs> he snorted coke off the sorting hat. It's all canon. It's all canon. It's all canon. <laughs> Fuck you, it's canon now. <laughs> If it comes out of her mouth, it's already canon, but... <laughs> I, am the, I am the god of this universe, and this all happened. <laughs> Fuck your childhood. <laughs> oh my god. And that's pretty much what it is, too. Like, again, like, I'm, I'm not gonna play, like, the... the oh the god. Like, oh my gosh, no, Dumbledore can't be a homosexual, because blah blah blah. No, it's, it's just like, why are you adding this information now? And, like, not actually putting it in the book where it would have made a difference to his character yeah you know? <laughs> and, and that's the thing is um and and she apparently said it like with at least with the old movies even though she never said it with the book because they were going to yeah. add like some new storyline or something about dumbledore's old love interest or something like that i just yeah. came out of this one didn't i 
Uh, this. no? No, no. okay. I, but no, this... do not go through there, because that's your way out. Do and that'll be where go. we're safe. I, I think you're close to another hippogriff. Hippogriff. <laughs> we'll, uh, and then once you do, we'll have to remember that door's here. Okay, so these aren't doors, thank goodness. I think I think the game dicks you and one of them actually is. Oh, but come I could on. be remembering one. I so hope just you check are. Them all, check <laughs> them all just to be sure. How? Those you know what? Okay. You gotta Dude. die. These things Dude. have to die. No, you gotta die, man. <laughs> actually, I those things don't hurt that much. I'm getting I'm taking a lot of hits, but um yeah, you are. I'm feeling pretty that's, that's invincible at this can. point. Yeah, now I'm, I'm you your your words got to me. Oh yeah, I Asshole. just made you paranoid. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm probably wrong, just so you know, but you know. I gotta check every last one now. I was gonna say, these SNES JRPGs, you actually kind of do have to check every You're right. Time, to be sure. You're absolutely right. Because they right. would place like the most obscure random secrets in these games. Dude, some of the, I know some of the red jewels I've missed are like impossible to find without a guide. Yeah. Kind of like some of the things in FF9, now that I think about it. They, they put some stupid, obscure things in that game to push, hawk their play online shit. Which I, I, right. I don't like it. I don't like that. I remember that. Hey, speaking of secrets, did you know that uh, <laughs> Luna, Lo <laughs> Luna Lovegood traveled back in time and she's actually... She's a time and, lord? <laughs> and, and, she's and, just getting into like copyright infringement territory. <laughs> Also, did you know that after graduating, Hermione oh, found God. it very difficult to find work, and so she opened up her own sex shop, and she briefly left Rob. Oh, no! Oh, shit! Ow. You're right, I'm gonna die. You need Will. Yeah, I do. Damn it. If that's the case, then I probably need Will for this whole thing. You need Will for quite a bit, apparently. There's... Yeah, but... They'll go yeah. down that staircase, just in case it's, um... Just in case the hippogriff is down here. At least I can make it easier on myself with Will yeah, later. Yeah, right, just kill everything. Just die. Yeah, just Will, die. Will would not be uh, carving a path through these guys at the same rate that Shadow is. Nah, that's true. I love that there's a... It goes left, it goes right, it goes up, it goes back through time. His <laughs> arm is just the greatest thing. Yeah, it goes... It hits above me for no reason. What is even doing that? Oh, you're right. Hey, speak yeah, the Those fucking enemies. guys. That's yeah. right. Hey, speaking of going back in time, did you know that Voldemort stole the uh, the, the the time device from Hermione and went back, and he actually instigated World War II? <laughs> it's canon. <laughs> Fuck you, it's canon. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> the producers just have a worried look on their faces. <laughs> Fuck you all, it's canon. <laughs> yeah, Vol Voldemort. Voldemort told Hitler to invade Poland. It's canon. <laughs> <laughs> Why though? Okay, I think I think that's about all I can do with uh, with this guy. Yeah, I think you actually do need Will for that next part. God damn it! Unless, wait a minute, double What's back it? there because hold on a second. D go back, go all the way back to the left and and back to that room because I'm wondering. I, wait, so it well, seems like nope. You're good right there. Aha! Trixie bastards. Oh, you this... should get an upgrade here. Okay, so the lasers, the lasers are invincible. But the, not... the lasers are invincible, but, but the, not the fireballs. projectiles, not so much. Nice. Hey, okay. I don't like these Those invisible suck. enemies. No, they suck. Because I'm so... assuming I'm gonna fight things later on in a different part of the room, and that's not always the case. Right. Okay, so here, go up and to your right. Now, it looks like we need Will's tornado to get through this part, right? Yeah. But when you get all the way over, I think... Isn't it that you have to use uh, the spooge to go down, or is there a staircase over there? The I mean, there must be a staircase, because... Oh, God. Oh, God, why have I done this to you? <laughs> yeah, no, I'm, I'm wrong, I'm wrong. <laughs> I just wanted to see you. Something. No, but my, my thought was there might be a way to get up there with Shadow because I felt like you needed to spooge once you got over to the right, but I think there's probably just a staircase. Oh, okay. I, because if there's that's no the case, other way to get yeah, up those then hills. I'm stuck. But, um, yeah. let's explore another, because I know there's there's not just one you do with Shadow. I feel like no. you're Shadow for most of this. So Though let's just keep going to the right. Do is switch to Will. And then we'll call it an episode, and then next time we'll do those two. The, yeah, so go through here. Which one? Which one am I in right now? I mean, I'll figure it out pretty quickly. You were quickly, the third. But, 
Okay, number three. So, so you skipped one because we need Will. You did the second one, and then that was number three because we need Will for that. All right. So as long as we remember that we need Will for one and three. We need we Will for the odd ones. For yeah. Yeah, because you didn't go all the way over here yet. No. Right you are. And there's six total. Okay, so next time I play the hits, I think we should be able to get through the pyramid. And I, I think we might. Be yeah, the pyramid. The pyramid's not too bad. It yeah. really isn't. No, so so we finish the pyramid next time, and then we get to the Tower of Babel after that, and that's it. I think. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. The end is in sight, my friend. Feels good, man. <laughs> yeah, I feel it does feel good to spooge, doesn't it? <laughs> You're welcome, YouTube, for this quality programming. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed. All right, man. We will, we will see you next time. See you next time. Oi.